A state appeals court has sided with Dallas County in its ongoing dispute with the governor over mask mandates. Andrea Lucia now to explain it all for you. There's currently a mask mandate in place at businesses. Dallas County Judge Clay Jenkins understands why there might be confusion. Back in July, Governor Greg Abbott issued an executive order barring government entities from requiring face coverings. But as COVID cases surged, Jenkins sued the governor and defied him, issuing an order mandating businesses require masks. That the governor does not have carte blanche uh, to run the state however he wishes in a time of emergency. Both a district court and now a court of appeals have agreed Abbott has no authority to act unilaterally to ban local mandates for face coverings. There are limits they found to the governor's emergency powers. This court's analysis says, you know, there's a lot of room in here, particularly in the short run when you're dealing with a hurricane, a tornado, but over time, it just sort of breaks down. The state has yet to comment on the ruling, and it could choose to appeal it to the Texas Supreme Court, a Republican-controlled court where it stands a better chance of winning. Well, we'll have to see what the attorney general and the governor want to do, but I'm not tired, and I will continue to stand uh, for your public health against uh, any other elected official. In the meantime, Jenkins says, don't let all the legal wrangling confuse you. you don't listen to what uh, uh, people tell you is legal. Listen to what doctors tell you is safe. Andrea Lucia, CBS 11 News. We did also, by the way, ask County Judge Jenkins how long he thinks it's going to be necessary to have a mask mandate for the county. He says he's going to leave it up to the health, uh, health experts who are advising him along the way.